My name is Andrew Kirk. I used to be a journalist and editor, and for many years I wanted to become a teacher, but did not see a way to go through the student teaching process. And the opportunity arose, and I've enjoyed the program through Central Washington University. And here I am in the middle of my student teaching, almost done. I'm very excited. Uh, coming from a journalism background, some things that were really exciting to me in this program is learning about different ways of doing cooperative and collaborative learning. In journalism, you have um, a, a team of people trying to understand all the different facets of uh, a phenomena and assigning students to tackle different parts of a project and um, share with each other what they've learned and their unique perspectives is a wonderful learning activity, in my opinion. I have also learned to truly value assessments for what they um, offer a teacher regarding um, actual proof about what students are learning and accomplishing and the ability to use assessments to challenge assumptions. I, um, because of my background, I also highly value diversity in the classroom and students being able to share diverse perspectives and have diverse experiences and draw from their own wells of knowledge um, to give unique perspectives to the information. Some of the big standouts from my student teaching experience with remote learning in the Richland School District is the lack of efficacy with asynchronous learning as um, someone who always did my own homework. I thought I could assign outside of classwork and the students would be happy to do it. And at the junior high age, um, they don't yet have the maturity and the skill sets to self-manage their, their time and their interest level. And so without the ability to use asynchronous learning, um, we've had a need to develop our Zoom skills. And We've also had to learn not to make any assumptions about what students know and uh, as far as even basic skills of um, how to write and how to answer questions and how to um, complete an assignment, even communication skills like how to ask a teacher about uh, making up work or a missing assignment or why an assignment isn't graded yet. Um, even the most basic academic skills um, are still being developed at the middle school level. And I also learned that Zoom uh, allows for a variety of instructional strategies. When remote learning started, I was afraid that I would just be um, talking to the camera the entire time. But um, there are many things, many different learning activities and experiences that you can give students through remote learning. And it's been exciting to experiment with um, different options. As you look through my in-task portfolio, I think something that's going to stand out is uh, the large number of lesson plans and emails that make up my artifacts. Um, I'm very proud of my lesson plans. I think they contain um, a good amount of variety, um, many different types of media. I think the lesson activities encourage students to ponder and share uh, different perspectives. And um, as uh, studying Washington State history, there's a lot of multicultural content and material. Uh, the emails to parents, I believe, show my uh, eagerness to collaborate with families and um, um, colleagues was the word that didn't come to me, um, to collaborate with families and colleagues to learn more about students and to discover um, the best ways to help students. Also, I think the emails to parents show me taking personal responsibility um, reaching out, trying to find out what I can do better to help students, what I can do in the classroom to make sure they succeed. Um, the emails show my commitment to positive encouragement and helping students feel like they can succeed and that I'm their partner in learning. And also my desire to engage in problem solving and not to blame families or blame administration or blame um, the remote learning, uh, but rather to take responsibility, as I said, to collaborate with colleagues and families and to positively problem solve um, and make sure students have the best experience possible. So hopefully you enjoy my portfolio.